Fourth, but first. It's the motto of the greatest fighter wing on earth and an enduring truth on this historic day at Seymour Johnson. The fourth fighter wing commander, Colonel Patrick Doherty, stepped down and Colonel Jeannie Levitt took the reins. Colonel Levitt is not only the first female fighter pilot in the U.S. Air Force, but also the first to command a fighter wing. Colonel Levitt reflects on the legacy of the fourth fighter wing and its accomplishments. It was during World War II that the fourth earned the motto, fourth but first. To this day, the men and women of the fourth fighter wing validate this motto through their unparalleled professionalism and dedication to duty. She also shared her goals and plans for Team Seymour in the years to come. How will we proceed into the future? First, we will be focused and committed to our mission. Second, will we take care and empower our people. Third, we will be good stewards of our resources. And across these three areas, we will live by the Air Force core values of integrity first, service before self, and excellence in all we do. And after she received her first salute as the commander of the 4th Fighter Wing, she closed with sound advice. The mission depends on every airman. If you are in the maintenance group, the medical group, the mission support group or the operations group, the wing staff or somewhere else within the wing, your role is critical to the success of the 4th Fighter Wing mission. From Seymour Johnson Air Force Base, I'm Senior Airman Tori Fleck.